Para pa. Para para pa. So guys, uh, I hope you really enjoy the last lesson that we did on Hot Shot series. And today it's going to be even more fun because there's going to be a lot of new speeches and a lot of new plans that is going to be covered today. So usually UPSC test on these kinds of questions. Last year you had like three questions coming from the new speeches or the rare speeches that has been like uh, finding its way through the Indian newspapers. And uh, so today I'll tell you the important speeches that have surfaced in the news recently. Okay. Uh, guys a humble request please do spread this initiative to many people as much as possible because we are started this channel as a service for those people who aspire agriculture as their career and for the people who take agriculture as their optional subject to clear UPSC and for those people who love agriculture and the people who love environment so this channel is mainly for those people who take agriculture as their profession and also their passion okay so please spread this initiative so that more people can be benefited so guys let's get started today so guys the first species star tortoises so this is going to be extremely crucial for your prelims point of view because what happened is uh, so in the chinnar wildlife sanctuary so chinnar wildlife sanctuary is located in kerala which is another prelims tidbits and uh, say they they launched an ambitious project uh, that is to seize all the indian star tortoises from the smugglers and they wanted to conserve it in the sanctuary okay so this was the program they undertook uh, so star tortoises so they form an important uh, age species of uh, the ecosystem so this makes uh, uh, chinnar wildlife sanctuary the only rehabilitation center for star tortoises so what they do is they collect all the star tortoises from the uh, poachers or the smugglers and they release into the environment again so like there there's another tidbit here that is tarutamma that is it's a particular variety of cactus so it is the food for the star tortoises okay so this can be also even asked so the next species is about on weaver birds so can you see uh, the picture that is the nesting of weaver birds on the right hand side so like a lot of weaver birds are mainly present at the rushikulya rukari in ganjam district at odisha so this is also a potential prelims question that is rushikulya rukari in ganjam district so it is also famous for the conservation of an important turtle so just name it in the comment section so like uh, there's been an article in the uh, Bonesur edition that usually these tiny industrious birds they start weaving the nets during the time of monsoons that is usually at the second week of May but this year the birds have started building this de their nest from the month of April itself okay so that is why there's been a hint of an early arrival of monsoon but it's not sure okay so like these are the key indicators of climate change that is weaver bird is also an important uh, like indicator for climate changing conditions. Uh, so guys uh, the next thing is about uh, coral reefs so like great barrier reef in australia is the largest site for all these beautiful species okay so recently scientists have discovered that vinegar the uh, that is uh, the ingredient that we used to add a taste to our food that is vinegar imparts a sensation of bitter to your food substances so like these vinegar can actually protect the great barrier reef so this was given by a scientist in his journal and this article is being published in Hindu last week. So, so the species that is causing huge damage to the coral reefs are called as cots, that is C O T S. So, they are otherwise called as crown of thorn starfish. Okay, so these crown of stars, uh, thornfish, they infect the uh, coral reefs and they destroy the entire coral reefs present in the Great Barrier Reef. So, recently, scientists have come up with an idea of introducing common household vinegar. So, this household vinegar is protecting Australia's most iconic. Uh, the next news is Chennai snake park gets green iguanas so iguanas are actually nothing but they are like huge giant lizards okay so like just see the color of the lizard so how majestic they look like and look at the skin tone so like they resemble like an, a head of a half dragon so that is how the shape looks like so let's see something about them so like iguanas are uh, usually not native to Indian they are like mostly native to the rainforest of Amazon of South America. So like Amazon rainforest is usually covering all the major 
like major state major countries of brazil venezuela ecuador peru so all the important northern half of the uh, south america has been covered by rainforest so like these green iguanas they have been procured by chennai snake park at gindi and they provide the latest attraction for the visitors okay so guys here's another potential upsc question so usually like many people will be preparing about amur falcons great indian bustard as well as some uh, vultures but upsc out of the blue they pick up a uh, species that is nowhere else been asked okay so such kind of question is this that is uh, recently a rare bird has been sighted at velayani panchakari wetlands so can you name where this wetland is present so like they have witnessed another rare sight seeing okay that is a bird which has come from nowhere and the identified bird is known to be as moran species so like these moran species they have a white plumage that is white color wings and they are like bubbly actually like they are like kind of a cute uh, birds so they inhabit reed beds freshwater wetlands marshes and irrigated lands so the uh, iucn category is least concern so this is also another potential i uh, upsc an option okay so please be focused so moran species least concern they are present at panchakari wetlands and this is how the options will actually look like in your exams also so just keep in your mind about these things because these are the ones that is going to appear in your prelims 2017 uh, so guys i hope you really enjoy this topic because these are the ones that will make you to read easily and without putting any efforts because all the species and all the new plants will excite you to read also this is not like any other polity or economics where you have to grind your mind so it's just like a match the following just like watching a discovery channel okay so guys please do support us in our venture and if you really like the video do press the thumbs up button and subscribe and share it to many as people as much as possible thank you